Yeah, let's start with the tax hit first, which a number of other lenders have That's referred to as well. Absolutely. I think yeah. that, that's probably uh, would have been, I would have assumed, largely priced in by now, given mm. that the U.S. banks have already come out and, you know, some of the other Europeans have too. I guess the, the news today will possibly be the, uh, the guidance that the bank has given on fourth quarter trading numbers, which yeah. um, are indicated to be down some 22%. And I think this might be where the market is focusing on now. Uh, clearly, uh, client activity has been down. Low levels of fourth quarter client activity it, in key areas exactly, is, is the headline. Exactly. Yeah. It, you know, that's not entirely a surprise, but of course, you know, you're seeing the extent of that now with mm. this guidance. Yeah. Uh, it adds to the woes of the lender, doesn't it? I mean, it's raised money, it's trying to produce revenue growth to the, to the annoyance of its uh, large shareholders. It isn't actually managing to eke any revenue growth out, isn't it? Well, this just adds to Crine's misery, doesn't it? it? It does sound that way. I mean, it, obviously, this year was a, a very... Uh, uh, sorry, right. Last year was a very um, busy year with a lot of restructuring, the capital raise. But, you know, the CEO had signalled to a return to modest growth. Mm. And, yes, it does doesn't seem like that is actually, you know, on the cards, certainly for 2017. Um, and, you know, we have reported that, you know, some of the key investors are getting a little bit um, anxious to see that turnaround actually delivering some results. Is this the year that, that, that Cryon doesn't see out another year we'll in his job? Obviously, but um, you know, that was the indication that we'd received, you know, um, almost you know, several weeks ago, if not months ago now, that you know, the patience among the investors was running out and they wanted to see results in the next couple of quarters. And, and, and Lisa, I mean, the fact that, you know, this client activity, is that a Deutsche Bank no, issue or not? No. no. Certainly not. But what we have seen is that they've struggled to regain market share in the areas where they've wanted to grow back. Um, and, and so we'll have to, you know, it's early days because these are the first numbers that we're seeing, really. Yes. So it's hard to compare to the rest of the street. But we'll know more um, as the U.S. earnings start next and week. And what's the outlook for the U.S. earnings season from a banking perspective? I think the focus will be, um, you know, very much on uh, the longer term implications mm. of the tax reform. And, you know, longer term, it's going to be um, giving, you know, banks opportunity to, to deploy more capital. And how they do that is what investors are going to be focusing on.